so thank you so much for those of you who asked some questions and there's just a couple one of them was what kind of nut milk, uh, nut milk bag I use and to I tend to get asked if I feel hungry I actually really don't feel hungry at all unless I need to drink some more juice and that really satisfies me so I feel very very satisfied I I think the biggest thing is just getting used to not like chewing something and the comfort of the different flavors and so I think you know food is can be very comforting for whatever reason <laughs> and so that's that was a real that's been the real challenge for me and at first I was just really getting used to how empty my stomach felt even though I w wasn't actually hungry so I'm getting used to that now I actually lost quite a bit of weight I I don't know exactly how much because I don't have a weigh scale and I just don't really like weighing myself I like just focusing on being healthy and happy so but I do have some before and after pictures coming for you probably tomorrow and I will show you the nut milk bag that I use when I get home and I will insert. This is a nut milk bag that I use. I purchased it from Amazon. They're really nice and big like this. Of course they turn all green when you use them. Soak in my bags in 3% hydrogen peroxide. I need to do this every five days. I actually used two sets of bags so I could just do it once a week. So definitely really important as you can see. Hey. And then the other question I had was the, um, the difference between using a cold pressed juicer for your greens or a high speed blender, Vitamix, Blendtec, whatever, with a nut milk bag, you know, what's better. Um, with all the researching I did, I did find out that using a high speed blender was way more it was way faster to do the amount you have to do every day and easier cleanup and higher yield for your produce and so that was just awesome I also used a cold pressed juicer myself for greens and yes that worked really good excuse me yes that worked really good but it was it, it is slower and I think to do five or four quarts of juice per day you might have to stop and clean it out possibly depending on what juicer you get I did have a very high quality one and I think it would be kind of difficult to stop and clean it out and do that although it's still doable it's still a very good way I I purchased the Slow Star juicer and it also had a little mincer attachment and I make like banana ice cream and stuff with it. It's delicious. But I definitely prefer the blender and nut milk bag just because it is so quick. You don't have to chop your vegetables so tiny so a lot less chopping and you just I just rinse mine with water every day and then kind of do a deep clean once a week because it's just vegetables and doesn't get really dirty so that is the answer to that and I look forward to talking to you again tomorrow thanks for following my journey and encouraging me and I'm glad that I can also encourage some of you and sending you tons and tons of love and appreciation and thanks and I hope you enjoy this amazing day it's getting really nice and sunny out so gorgeous okay talk to you soon